Don't miss out on the special offer from my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They're currently giving you 20% off if you use my coupon code Poodle at checkout and also giving you an additional 10% coins at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Mad Dolphin Team video. And today I'm going to be going over the Positional Hero promo. I know I'm about a day or two late. I'm sorry about that. Got caught up in stuff. Typically, content on Madden isn't always my strongest suit on this channel, but I'm trying to position myself that way, being an all around YouTuber when it comes to Madden and the Madden standpoint. Now, First off, guys, I plan to make three videos today. Hopefully, I can make one on the house rules. I can make one on the positional heroes, and I'm blanking, but there was something else. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, do me a favor and drop a sub. Also, guys, I'm going to start getting back to what I used to do with the like goals and the giving away coins because we're at that point in the year where I don't really care about my coins too much, so I have 500K. I think I'll give away all of it, or better yet, I'll do this. So, I could give you players, or I could give you the coins, but for now... Screw the players. If you guys comment down below 500k and we hit 100 likes, hmm, that's a little slow. 150 likes. If we hit 150 likes and you guys comment down below 500k, I'll pick a random commenter. Com yeah, comment there. And you guys get all of the coins that I have in my account. And over time, I'll start giving away my team. I'll give away my Mac, my Vernon Davis, every card, my Kelsey, if I still even have that. I don't remember, but you get, you get the point. So that's about it, guys. Let's get into the video. Don't forget, comment down below 500k. Let's get to 150 likes. So run up the like, hit the like button. Also, I never asked this, but if you guys are loyal watchers, turn on the post notification, the little bell button. Helps me out a lot when you guys come and give me immediate interactions. And if you guys are gonna watch me anyways, at least turn it on. Helps me out. But it goes get into the video. So first off, we have the positional heroes. I'm going to the sets to show you guys the two specific cards. It is T.Y. Hilton, I believe Jalen Ramsey. Oh, wait, is there two? Oh, there's two. Okay. There's Kyle Juice. Kyle and T.Y. Hilton. So to get these, you need fullbacks, obviously. So for this one, it's going to be 94, 95, 92, 93, 92, 93, 89, 91. So what do you guys notice off the bat? Because what I notice is that players are going to drastically go up in price at least 15% per. That's my first uh, initial initial thing I recognize. Now, wide receivers are a little more because it's 96, 97. Now, before I keep getting into this, what I did learn on Twitter yesterday is that you can use power-up cards which is pretty cool. So I can toss in my Champ Bailey right here, and then I can toss in a bunch of, I could literally make, I can make this Jalen Rams right now. I think I'm gonna do it. Should I do it? Wow, I literally can make this Jalen Ramsey. That's crazy. But let me just show you guys something real fast. So if you look at some of the prices of these cards, if you come on over, you will see that they have went up. Now this is the time of the year, Positional Heroes, Famously, since Madden 13, or as long as I can remember, has been a good time for binder cleaning. So people have tons of crap in their binder that they don't need anymore, but they don't go for anything. There's a time of the year when players like in your binder that you didn't think would go for anything start to go for stuff. So if you were going to clean out your binder and then go sell some coins or anything, now would be the time. So if you go over to cornerback, I have 82. So this Ty Law, I think I picked up for about 20k. He is now going for 34k. So that's already 14k plus. This 88 overall typically would probably go for like 15k, 14k, 22k. So if you guys can see, clearly everything's going up about like 10% to 14%. And this one more so, and some of these actually, you know, this one went up like almost 40%. I actually, okay, I have the Carlton Davis. This was like 7k before. Okay, there's, a, there's a 9k, but then it's 11k. But you can literally make a profit on any cornerback in this game. This Dick LeBeau, I'm pretty sure, was like 7K. Now he's 10, 11K. Once this one sells, 11, 13. So right now, I'd clean out all your binders. And now, I'm going to go over also which ones I'd recommend if you're going to do them. I think I would recommend the Jalen Ramsey. I don't know if I'm just saying that because I happen to have a lot of them. But this Pat Pete, I'm going to go look on the auction block what they're going for also because obviously, I don't want to take off all the cams and stuff. But if I show you guys here, I think, I, I think it'd be the time. I would, I would sell every position that i have that comes out so right now i'd sell all my cornerbacks if i were you guys i'll probably be making the jalen ramsey though so that's why i won't be selling mine but i'm just gonna make it just to, for shits and giggles just to make it because i can but if, if you guys don't plan on keeping it or using it i would sell it so come over to cornerbacks and go to 98 99 let's see what the prices are looking like we got night train lane at 145 wow that is cheap is that well he's not in the set i don't think 98's going to the set right there's 96 97s 
Wow, so I guess if you're not if you're not available to be in the set, you go down because of this Ramsey. Wow, this Ramsey card is crazy good. Let me go check this out. What's his jumping 96? That's huge. What's his oh uh, who is see what kills him is his juke and his spin and his, his agility. He doesn't have open field running, which kind of sucks, like a Deion Sanders does. But that card is definitely insane. I'm definitely gonna get that card. But besides that, let me go over to the ones that do matter. 96 97s as you can see the 96 97s are almost the price if not almost the same price as the 98s so they obviously went up in price due to just the demand for finishing right now now let's check out receivers i know those are also going up so the 98s went down a ton oh my oh my god the market crashed the market literally crashed positional heroes killed it and ironically the 96 97s that are needed for the set are gonna be more valued see like they, they should be way lower right now when their higher cards are higher these cards should definitely not be this high but as you can see the top end guys i don't think would be the best place to make your coins on i think it'd be more so on the lower end guys in my opinion so as you can see the 88 89 receivers are all going for upwards of 10k these were going for below they were, these are going for about 7k now they're all going for like 11 to 12k so you could just sell the majority of your binder and make a decent return to be completely honest now let's check the fullbacks see how they're looking 88 overall fullbacks going for 24k 88 overalls do not go for anything above 8k prior to this week maybe 10 at max depending on the position but i believe jamal adams is there too so that means they're strong safeties they're going for 11 but the fullbacks if you have fullbacks i would sell those in a heartbeat that is where you're going to make the money right now hopefully we got some fullbacks in our binder definitely going to be selling those uh, let's see how much golds are going for too because if you have some decent amount of gold you can probably make a decent return on that so i head over to my binder i'm gonna check the fullbacks and the, and the gold cornerbacks so let's see if the golds have any value here they definitely will but i don't know if it's gonna be like enough value to be like happy about so let's see we go to 75 79 okay not too much 1k is not horrible if you have a bunch i mean honestly if they're all 1k and you have a ton of them that's not really that bad I don't know if that set required gold. I don't think it did. Maybe. But it's irrelevant anyways. What's more important to me is seeing if I have some fullbacks to show you guys these prices right now. Hopefully I have some fullbacks. I have none. Shit. All right. Well, that could have been some nice coins. But I'm going to start wrapping up this video soon. Going to open two gold player packs on the way out of here just because. Should I do get a gold or no, I'm do gold player? gonna open them up real quick still waiting for a limited time pull still waiting for a banger pull have not gotten one all year we got a power up and we get rob gronkowski we get a high legend 93 ray lewis okay that was a pretty good pack i don't know how much it's gonna be going for but i will open another one that's not bad at all hope you guys enjoyed the recap of the positional hero um, promo by the way elite 85 damon harrison okay these are good right now hope i helped you guys a little bit go over what you guys think you should be doing if I were you guys, I'd just be selling. I'd be selling a lot to check the prices Ray Lewis. But yeah, I'd be selling. I definitely would not be holding on to a lot of these cards at these positions because once they, once they're not that relevant anymore and the position here dies down a little bit, those cards will go back to their normal prices. The market is infinitely down though. It's done. It's no matter what that market, the market will be killed from now on. I will make a separate video going over that specifically in a different video. That's probably what I do in my other video today. So that was 48 carat. That's a pretty good pack. So now guys, I have 600k. So... I'm giving away all the coins on my account so 150 likes guys comment down below 500k give me coins whatever you want and if i hit 150 likes on any of these videos for the next the next month if i had 150 likes on any video in the next month i will probably do it but let's start with today's video the quicker you guys do it the more coins i'll give away we can hit this one i'll start giving away players the Khalil mac a lot of things you understand that you guys get the concept so hopefully we hit it helps me out helps you guys out toss you some coins toss you some players i have plenty of players up for grabs plenty of players i'll show you right now if i don't get the coins i can definitely give you guys i can take my calvin out i can give you Khalil mac i can give you sean taylor i can give you champ no i can't give you champ bailey i can give you ogden i can give you pat pete i can give you odell i can give you vic not like no i can't that's a lie i don't have the right vic for that i can give you uh nope i can give you dion tyree kill a lot of Jamal Adams, Robbie Gould. I could do a lot. So 
hopefully you guys like the video let's start getting the giveaway season on and thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys have enjoyed the content if you have make sure to drop the likes make sure to drop a sub be doing this probably probably going to be doing something similar to this from here until madden 20 where i give away something in every video as long as we hit the like goal so turn on the post notification bell button and so you guys can get alerted for every new video we do athletic guys thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed i'm out see you in the next one